Everything we hear is an opinion, not a fact. Everything we see is a perspective, not the truth. It is not death that a man should fear, but he should fear never beginning to live. Direct thy attention to what is said. Let thy understanding enter into the things that are doing and the things which do them. Nature in no case cometh short of art, for the arts are copiers of natural forms. The opinion of ten thousand men is of no value if none of them know anything about the subject. The things you think about determine the quality of your mind, your soul takes on the color of your thoughts. Live your life as if you are ready to say goodbye to it at any moment, as if the time left for you were some pleasant surprise. You don't have to turn this into something, it doesn't have to upset you. Things can't shape our decisions by themselves. Very little is needed to make a happy life it is all within yourself, in your way of thinking. How much more grievous are the consequences of anger than the causes of it? The body of an actor can be either his best friend or his worst enemy. Nowhere can man find a quieter or more untroubled retreat than in his own soul. Why should we feel anger at the world, as if the world would notice? Soon you will have forgotten the world, and soon the world will have forgotten you. If unwilling to rise in the morning, say to thyself, Ay, I awake to do the work of a man. You have power over your mind, not outside events. Realize this, and you will find strength. Waste no more time arguing about what a good man should be. Be one. Body, soul, mind, sensations, the body, desires, the soul, reasoning, the mind. How powerful is man? He is able to do all that God wishes him to do. He is able to accept all that God sends upon him. Whatever anyone does or says, I must be emerald and keep my color. Perhaps there are none more lazy, or more truly ignorant, than your everlasting readers. Death smiles at us all, all a man can do is smile back. Humans have come into being for the sake of each other, so either teach them, or learn to bear them. Accept whatever comes to you woven in the pattern of your destiny, for what could more aptly fit your needs? A little flush, a little breath, and a reason to rule all a that is myself. No one was ever injured by the truth but he who persists in self-deception and ignorance is injured. The impediment to action advances action, what stands in the way becomes the way. Look well into thyself there is a source of strength which will always spring out if thou wilt always look. When you arise in the morning think of what a privilege it is to be alive, to think, to enjoy, to love. Loss is nothing else but change, and change is nature's delight. Nothing happens to anybody which he is not fitted by nature to bear. For it is in your power to retire into yourself whenever you choose. Whoever values peace of mind and the health of the soul will live the best of all possible lives. Choose not to be harmed and you won't feel harmed. Don't feel harmed and you haven't been. The first rule is to keep an untroubled spirit. The second is to look things in the face and know them for what they are. Life is neither good or evil, but only a place for good and evil. The happiness of your life depends upon the quality of your thoughts. Be not careless in deeds, nor confused in words, nor rambling in thought. Accept the things to which fate binds you, and love the people with whom fate brings you together, but do so with all your heart. Whatever the universal nature assigns to any man at any time is for the good of that man at that time. It never ceases to amaze me, we all love ourselves more than other people, but care more about their opinions than our own. Do not act as if you were going to live 10,000 years. Death hangs over you, while you live, while it is in your power, be good. Be like the cliff against which the waves continually break but it stands firm and tames the fury of the water around it. It's silly to try to escape other people's faults, they're inescapable. Just try to escape your own. Remember that very little is needed to make a happy life. Everything that happens happens as it should, and if you observe carefully, 
you will find this to be so. Stop whatever you're doing for a moment and ask yourself, am I afraid of death because I won't be able to do this anymore? There was a dream that was Rome, you could only whisper it, anything more than a whisper and it would vanish, it was so fragile. Whoever it is wrong, wrongs himself to whoever does injustice, does it to himself, making himself evil. Look back over the past, with its changing empires that rose and fell, and you can foresee the future, too. The only wealth which you will keep forever is the wealth you have given away. External things are not the problem, it's your assessment of them, which you can erase right now. The only thing that isn't worthless, to live this life out truthfully and rightly, and be patient with those who don't. Dwell on the beauty of life, watch the stars, and see yourself running with them. Let not your mind run on what you lack as much as on what you have already. The cucumber is bitter, then throw it out. There are brambles in the path, then go around, that's all you need to know. Because a thing seems difficult for you, do not think it impossible for anyone to accomplish. Every living organism is fulfilled when it follows the right path for its own nature. Your time has a limit set to it, use it, then, to advance your enlightenment or it will be gone, and never in your power again. Life is short, do not forget about the most important things in our life, living for other people and doing good for them. How much time he saves who does not look to see what his neighbor says or does or thinks. Past and future have no power over you, just the present A and even that can be minimized. Take me and cast me where you will I shall still be possessor of the divinity within me, serene and content. It doesn't hurt me unless I interpret its happening as harmful to me, I can choose not to. Live out your life in truth and justice, tolerant of those who are neither true nor just. The stone that is thrown into the air is none the worse for falling down, and none the better for going up. If you are pained by any external thing, it is not this that disturbs you, but your own judgment about it. Bear in mind that the measure of a man is the worth of the things he cares about. When pain is unbearable it destroys us when it does not it is bearable. Never esteem anything as of advantage to you that will make you break your word or lose your self-respect. The object of life is not to be were on the side of the majority, but to escape finding oneself in the ranks of the insane. Alexander the Great and his mule driver both died and the same thing happened to both. Life is short, that's all there is to say. Get what you can from the present A thoughtfully, justly. In the morning, when you are sluggish about getting up, let this thought be present, A I am rising to a man's work. If any man despises me, that is his problem, my only concern is not doing or saying anything deserving of contempt. Find joy in simplicity, self-respect, and indifference to what lies between virtue and vice. Love the human race, follow the divine. In reading and writing, you cannot lay down rules until you have learned to obey them, much more so in life. Look within, within this is the fountain of good, and it will ever bubble up, if thou wilt ever dig. Thanks for watching, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe.